Hello, Geminis. How are you guys doing? Welcome to my channel. What is going on with my Gemini Sun, Moon, Venus signs? Sun, Moon, Venus signs, guys. I hope everything is going well with you guys. I hope you guys are in a positive vibration. I just wanted to start with that. Um, and I love you guys. Um, okay, so announcements. If you guys are interested in a personal reading, a soul to soul personal reading um, where I connect with your guides, look in the description box below. Okay. And of course, like and subscribe if you haven't already. And hello to my subscribers. So let's see what's going on with my beautiful Gemini's. Gemini, Sun, Moon, Venus signs. Okay. Gemini's. What is going on with my Gemini's? Victory. Victory, victory, victory. Okay. I feel like you guys are stepping into your strength at this time. You're stepping into... Um, a place of releasing control, right? Going after what you want. Remaining focused here, okay? <laughs> Something just popped up in my head. It's so interesting. So if any of you guys like really enjoy wearing block heels, okay? That's for somebody, Nelma. All right, if anybody here enjoys wearing block heels or these sort of heels, I feel like moving into the summer spring here there's a strong energy male or female um of victory i feel free i'm going after what i want i'm finding that energy of stability i'm becoming more stable okay and i feel like that is actually once you begin to allow yourself to feel again okay I feel like you guys are in a place where there may be a lot of emotions at this time. And I feel like possibly you're not able to decipher or you're not really able to focus here. Okay. I have a lot of built up emotions. I have a lot of emotions towards a situation, towards a person. Okay. That I invested a lot of energy into here. Okay. I do see a very strong friend energy here, okay? Um, this could be pertaining to work or it could be pertaining to someone that may be your friend here. I see you opening up to someone and releasing your emotions and just telling them exactly how you feel. And I feel like once you do that, you step into an energy of feeling free, feeling balanced, feeling stable, feeling content, right? It's going to actually put you in a place where it's like, I needed to do this, right? And I feel like there's going to be this energy. Even people around you are just going to help you with this, right? Where there's support. There's like a round of applause, right? A moment of a round of applause for for this victory for you here, okay? So let's dig and let's see what's going on with my Geminis, okay? What is going on with my beautiful Geminis? I do feel like you guys are going after what you want, after what makes you feel stable, okay? Very, very happy energy, okay? You may have somebody around you that may be coming off like they're happy, but they may be drinking or indulging in a lot here. Somebody that was possibly very materialistic to some extent, okay? Geminis, please. Thank you. What is this? So we have reach out. Okay. And we have new beginnings. <laughs> Bottom of the deck, we have waiting. Okay. For some of you guys, you may be waiting for some sort of communication from someone, waiting for somebody to open up. Okay. Because there's a strong energy of feeling alone. Yeah. I feel alone. I feel as if... I'm in a relationship or I'm not in a relationship, but I feel alone in, in this situation. I feel like nobody truly understands what I'm trying to say, what I'm trying to communicate, okay? I do feel like, again, there will be a very strong energy of a new beginning that comes in here once someone decides to um, release something, once someone decides to open up about how they feel okay i do see some of you guys opening up to friends opening up to a individual and telling them exactly 
how you feel, okay? And I feel like you're at this point where after I did that, you know, after I decided to open up and express to this person um, my deepest emotions, something I've been holding back for a while, right? I'm no longer waiting. I'm no longer waiting for their response. I'm no longer waiting for them to um, give me the okay to move within my power, okay? I do see a lot of you guys wanting to start something new, start a new journey, okay? But I feel like there's a strong energy of somebody needing to open up, okay? Open up about how they feel about a relationship that may be very unstable, Okay, could be a relationship with a family member, could be a relationship with a friend, but this is an energy that's very strong around you at this time. Okay, I feel like I'm alone. Someone may have a drinking issue. Okay, for some of you guys here. But again, I'm in a relationship and the more I wait, the more I, I wait to, to get some sort of okay from you, the more I feel alone. Okay in this waiting energy here it's like a very lonely place i feel like someone's um indulging in here but i feel like someone sets themselves free right i'm setting myself free catch up if you can i'm hearing catch up if you can okay because i feel like you're putting everything on the table okay what else do we have here one more please for my gemini's nostalgia yeah i think about you all the time i miss what we had i miss our connection right bottom of the deck we have commitment phobe here okay somebody here that may not be giving that commitment that is not meeting you halfway okay i feel like this person could be traveling or you could be traveling and you found out something about this person Okay, how they possibly may be going backwards with their commitment here. Okay, a strong energy of I don't completely understand what you want to do, right? I don't completely understand where your heart is. Okay, it's a, it's a blur. I don't get it. And I feel like you guys are more so thinking about the past. I'm thinking about how good things were. Okay. And I feel like this person has some sort of remorse, but I feel like this person's very comfortable, okay? And they're not really opening up here. They're not letting you see the message. They're not letting you get an idea of what is truly going on with them here, okay? For some of you, there may be no communication. Let's see how this person may be feeling here. See, there's a lot of lust as well. We have lust at the bottom of the deck here, okay? For some of you, you're feeling like this is, you know, more so a connection filled with lust or um, this person just has lust on their mind, okay? For a lot of my Geminis, this may be a new person that you're meeting and you are expressing to them that um, you're not okay with something that they're possibly offering you, okay? You don't feel like it's stable. You don't feel like it's stable. I do feel like this person possibly reaches out as if you know, one day they're a friend, one day they're a lover, one day they want companionship, the next day they don't. Okay. What else is going on, please? Thank you. Patience. Patience. I'm willing to be patient here. And that's when a message comes in. All right. I'm willing to be patient with myself. Seduced. Yeah. This is somebody here that definitely tries to seduce you here this is someone that's very charming okay very very charming energy and i feel like this is what this person's going to use in terms of trying to get back or trying to reconnect here after realizing that you're realizing that things aren't moving here okay or this person uses that tactic or has used it in the past here okay there's a lot of seduction, a lot of passion here, though. I don't really feel like this is a person that is just using you. I do feel like there's a lot of love here, okay? Some of you guys you met at work, but I feel like this person is not really meeting you halfway in terms of telling you why they're not extending that love, okay? That, that effort, okay? Please tell me more about this situation, please. Gemini, Sun, Moon, Venus signs. Yeah. Gemini's. 
for some of you guys, there's, it's like I was out and I met this person and we connected, but for some reason, this person doesn't want to commit. Someone around you is not wanting to commit, okay? Not wanting to commit here, okay? Just tell me more about this. Gemini, thank you. Yeah. Mm. This person's coming from a... For some of you guys, this person may be coming from a very dark place. Possibly they're not really expressing it. Okay? I feel like this is someone here, or this could be you, wanting to release your past and wanting to take that leap here. I do see some of you guys wanting to try this again with someone, wanting to um, start new with someone here. Okay? I would love to start new. I would love to try this again with you here. And I feel like this is what this person may be vocalizing to you. Right? Let's release the baggage. Let's start this over. Gemini's. How's my Gemini's feeling? How's my Gemini's feeling, please? How does my Gemini's feel? Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. Let's see. Bottom of the deck, we have the Queen of Swords. So you guys are definitely creating these boundaries, these standards. Yeah, for some of you guys, you, you know, there's a strong confusion that comes in of, you know, I'm not too sure, you know, like it's, I'm not too sure. And it's like something that you're really thinking about. Okay, I'm not too sure if I want to travel and, and come and see you. I'm not too sure if I want to go back there. Okay, for some of you guys, you were possibly um, planning to do something else and this person came in and stirred up some confusion. Okay, I do feel like for some of you also, this is someone here that was very confident about moving forward and not really wanting to start something new with you. But now I feel like there's an energy of missing you, wanting to reach out, wanting to reconnect. Okay, because I feel like when you were opening up to this individual, they truly didn't want to hear it. Okay, it was a, you know, it, it's, they were very s stern and, and very grounded within their decision. Okay, earth sign, Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo here, or Pisces, I'm hearing. But again, like I said, you know, I feel like, if you guys do go back to this or try this again, I feel like there's going to be um, a very intense conversation. And I feel like it's really coming from you where you're expressing to this person um, what you're looking for and what you're seeking in a relationship, how you plan on moving forward. This is my plan, right? This is something that I want to do, right? Again, with the strong energy, someone here is very, very alone, but they miss that love, that affection, or they dream about it, or yeah, someone here is just in this energy of, could we cuddle? You know what I mean? Could we, could we be together? Could this, could this be positive? Okay. Cause I feel like someone here feels like they've been waiting for so long and I constantly feel like I'm being approached by those that are not stable. Or why am I constantly focused on this person that truly doesn't understand that I just want something that's equal, okay? Yeah, okay. But again, like I said, a lot of you guys, you know, this boundary that comes up, right? This um, energy of this is what I'm looking for, for myself. It comes from a very painful place, right? Um, possibly you came out of a marriage or you came out of something that really hurt, okay? And you're remembering everything that you went through. And this is what is actually happening right now. I feel like there's this energy of, oh, right? Although I want to start something over, I have to remember my boundaries. I have to, right? Because this was entirely painful, Right. I felt like I was powerless. I felt like I was depending on someone. I felt like I didn't have anybody. So now as I move forward, I have to remember the past lessons. 
Okay, so I do see someone here um, definitely in this place. And once you do step into this, I see a lot of love coming your way. A lot of commitment coming your way, right? Where someone here wants to offer you something, Gemini. Very serious energy. Very serious energy. Yeah. This could be, you know, somebody here that may be very focused on their finances as well. And they may express that to you. Okay. And I feel like this person may really want to know if you're ready, you know? For some of you guys, you may reject this person, but are you truly ready for something new here, okay? Because I feel like you guys are coming off, you know, very quiet, very guarded here. This may be a conversation you're having with someone that you truly love. And as you have this conversation, Gemini, I feel like you are going to feel... Like this person's not opening up here. This person's not wanting to meet me halfway. This person's holding back. Okay? This person's holding back and they're keeping something from me. All right? That's for some of you guys here. Yeah. Okay. This could be someone here that's very fearful as well, Gemini. Very fearful. Okay? It's like they, they may suffer from overthinking right? Overthinking about their finances, overthinking about, you know, missing out on something or possibly something failing for them, possibly losing their job or losing their marriage. I feel like this person may not be able to express how they truly feel because they're holding something back. Okay. And I feel like you're going to notice that you're going to say like, yeah, this is why, you know, we're not able to start this journey together again and, and it's okay right I feel like you're going to express to this person that it's okay right and I'm not I'm not going to force you here okay I do feel there's a very strong energy of somebody having a hard time understanding why someone isn't loving them the way that they have promised to love them, right? Like, I'm not understanding why you don't want to reconcile here, okay? I don't understand why you're going back and forth and you're being so protected. Could be a cancer or somebody that has heavy cancer in their chart. Someone very, very protected here, okay? It's like they go back and forth, back and forth with what they truly want, back and forth, back and forth very confused energy here okay guys and i feel like you you are coming to a a decision ultimately here because you're starting to realize if i follow the confused leader i won't really make i won't really make it out of this you know because i feel like your person may be very confused because they do have some um stability issues in terms of being ready to open up and being ready to start this journey or being ready to heal something. Okay. So let's see what this person has to say here. Gemini. Or what you have to say. Gemini. Sun, moon, Venus signs. Okay. If you guys could please subscribe and like if this resonates with you, of course. Let's see. Oh, okay. Okay. It says, I am focused on you instead of my pain. Yeah. For a lot of you guys, you found yourself focusing on other people or focusing on this person instead of healing, instead of working on yourself. Okay. And this could be your person as well. Okay. On both sides. We're focusing on this relationship instead of understanding why or what it is that we're running from. Right. I'm focused on you instead of my pain at this time. I really want to know if you want to do this over. I really want to know if you love me, okay? And I feel like bottom of the deck, you guys get into a place where you say, I love myself enough to walk away from something that doesn't serve me, okay? I will talk to you guys soon. Again, if you guys are interested in a personal reading, my information is below. I love you. Have a good day. Bye.